inspiration can come from the most unexpected places. Here at The Real, we're all about honoring those who give their all and expect nothing in return. That's why I cannot wait until you hear the story that we have today. Get ready, it's time for The Real Deal. Trinity High School in Euless, Texas, there's one exceptional man who has truly gone above and beyond his duty. He has mentored hundreds of teens, put clothes on their backs, fed them, and has sometimes even stepped in as a father figure. He happens to be the head custodian. Please welcome Mr. Charles Clark. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Mr. Clark, how long have you been a custodian there at Trinity? I've been at Trinity 23 of the 25 years I worked wow. for the school district. Wow. 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 So tell us, how have you managed to become the most influential mentor at Trinity High School? How did it all start? Uh, I started in Trinity in 1989, mm -hmm. six months after I started there. I heard a story about a young lady who had got kicked out of the house or whatever. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it was the Friday before the last day of school for Christmas. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. And my mind was, this baby's going to wake up Christmas morning without a gift. Wow. And I called my wife. I said, sweet Kate, you got to go get this baby something for Christmas. Mm -hmm. She went and got a beautiful sweater, beautifully arranged. Word got out. Next thing I knew, I had hundreds of uh, kids who needed daddies. Wow. just somebody to wow. encourage them. And the thing about it, Trinity, they embrace me doing what I do. Oh. That's awesome. That's awesome. You know, you stepping in and being that father figure or that mentor, what do you think would happen to a lot of these kids, you know, had you not stepped in and been there for them? Well, I can't say they wouldn't have made it, but one thing I do know, mm -hmm. the ones that took my advice, yeah. mm -hmm. followed my leadership, most of all, followed the love that I gave them, yes. mm -hmm. turned out to be successful. Wow. 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 Sometimes that's all they need, right? Yeah. A little bit of love and some advice, knowing someone cares about them. And you know, Mr. Clark, we need more people like you Absolutely. to help our young people out. You know yes. what I'm saying? So we really appreciate it. We cannot thank you enough. But we're not the only ones that want to thank you, Mr. Clark. No, <laughs> not at the real. Take a look at this tape. Mr. Clark is an amazing man. He's a very nice guy. My father figure, like, he... Does everything he can for me. Willing to give the shirt off his back for anybody that needs it, even if he ain't got it. One of the, the best guys I know. Father figure to me, and he told me that he'll watch out for me if, until I graduate. Thank you, Mr. Clark. Thank you, Mr. Clark. Thank you, Mr. Clark. Thank you, Mr. Clark, for everything. Love you. Thank you, Mr. Clark, for all you do at Trinity. Thank you, Mr. Clark. We appreciate everything you do, my man. Thank you, Mr. Clark. Thank you, Mr. Clark, for everything you do at Trinity. that you are so loved and appreciated by the kids at Trinity High School. And we also know that there's one special former student at Trinity that you and your wife actually consider a son. So he wanted to be here to present you with our very special Real Deal Award. Chase Weber, come on out. Oh my God. <laughs> have a seat. Have, have a seat. seat. Have a seat. Have a seat. Let's go sit down. Ooh, so, Mr. Clark, you the got emotional. I know. You have all of us crying. Charles. <laughs> what's up, old man? How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Charles, I just want to thank you for everything you've done for me, man. Um, you're truly a blessing on this earth for you've impacted so many people. Um, you're the first man that I've ever respected oh. in my life. Wow. And um, not growing up with a father, he became that father figure that I needed. I just want to say I love you. I, I thank you for everything you do. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Clark, thank you so much for coming by and for everything you do out of the kindness of your heart. 